So for those of you that don't know, the Grammys carpet is like four hours. So I'm going to take you through this Grammy thing in about 27 minutes because uh, I know y'all don't got four hours to look at all this. That's uh, Leon Bridges. He's a nice new cat. Um, I might check out his music. He got something called Coming Home. He sounds like kind of old school, like some old Sam Cooke type stuff, but, he, but he's cool. He's cool. You'll like him. Um, Leon Bridges, uh, yeah, check him out. Uh, who else we got here? That's Tiffany Haddish and Jason Lee. I love Tiffany Haddish. I, I love that's my girl. I love Tif- Tiffany Haddish, and, and then that's Jason Lee. But I love Tiffany Haddish, you know, and this look that she got on. She's uh, you know, she's been on the Oscars carpet and everything else, and uh, that's Jason Lee. Hollywood unlocked or something. Yeah, Jason Lee. Yeah. All right, back to Tiffany Haddish. I love her. So, yeah, check that out. She's looking good. What y'all think about the dress? I think it's cool. I think it's cool. I like, I don't know about the finger waves, but, you know, Tiffany can rock it with it. You know, she can rock it. Carrie Underwood. Now, that's my girl. Y'all don't, y'all might not know her because I don't know what type of music y'all listen to, but he's like, I've got the little toy guns. No stone, no bullet, no. I like I like Carrie Underwood. You know, I'm, I, I like a couple of little songs. That's a nice little look. Nice little look. I like the dress. I don't know about the sash. It kind of looked like uh, I don't know, but it's, it's, it's cute. I like it. I like it. Carrie can get it. She's cool. Let's see who we got coming up next. Um, uh, and then. Oh, what's the Melanie Thornton? Is she from Pussycat Dolls? Like, I, you know, I don't know why Melanie Thornton's there. Cause I, I, Pussycat Dolls ain't made music in a decade or so, but I don't know. What? Maybe she got something to sing about. I, I don't know. I don't want to uh, begrudge her, but you know, that's Melanie Thornton. Don't know about the look. Don't know if it's working. Y'all girls tell me. I don't know. I'm not the fashion guru. This is the non-fashion guru. Red carpet recap. Yeah, I mean, she, she, she's, I don't, uh, that, I don't know who that was. Hit boy. All right, then, then they got uh, who is this? This is, this is an unusual Taylor Parks. I'm not exactly sure who she is or why she chose this outfit. Or what's going on with that? But I guess she needed to stand out, and she did. She made it to the video, and I don't know if she is. You know, I'm not a music guru, but I guess if that's your thing, the I I don't know what Dragon Ball Z. It was, I don't know. This is uh, what's her name? Uh, Chrissy Teigen. She's a social media influencer. Yeah, that's a nice dress. Uh, she used to have a lot of fans. She kind of got, you know, they kind of like started uh, tripping on her for some stuff she said on social media. They tried to cancel her, and she's a social media influencer. So I don't know. Like, she maybe done a comeback to her, or whatever. I think she had went quiet for a while. I don't know all the gossip tea, whatever. And then there's John Legend. That's her husband, and he's got a lot of music. I think he might have got he got some Grammys. He's probably presented and performing this year i like his tux i think the tux is smooth that what is that velvet what is that velvet i don't know tux looks good i like john legend and uh that's his wife social media influencer chrissy Teigen. so there's john legend he's supposed to be there grammy carpet look at that velvet smooth all right and chrissy Lavelle Crawford, now, now, this is Lavelle and his son. He be cutting on his son in these comedy shows. I wouldn't even walk the carpet with Lavelle. That was my dad, but y'all like Noah from Breaking Bad, all the comedy. I love Lavelle. He good. He good peeps. This is, what's this girl named? Uh, uh, Snow, Snow Allegra? Snow Allegra, something like that? And she's, uh, I don't know. She's R&B. I, I don't know much about her. I got to check it. I got to check it out. I gotta check it out. But, uh, yeah. That's her deal. 
She look good though. I like the like the look. I like the look. I like the look. Who we got next? Halsey. This girl, I like her look. She got the class. I like Halsey. I don't know if y'all are all familiar with her, but she did like this track with um with uh Post Malone and Future. Is it a die? Will you die for me? Something like that. But yeah, that's that's uh that's Halsey. I like the look of she got the little shorts on on the skirt, though. She goes out like that. It does sneak up on people. But yeah, that's... Yeah, that's all I do. I like the hat. The hat's a cool look. This is Donatella Versace. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that's... Yep, I've spent all that money on Versace. That's Donatella Versace. Going once, going twice. What y'all think about the look? I'm guessing she wearing a Versace, right? I mean, shit. What else would she be wearing? Donatella Versace. I ain't gonna hate. Somebody for everybody. Uh, that's St. Vincent. She, I don't know. I don't know what she does now. I don't remember if it's on Twilight soundtracks way back in the day, but maybe she's nominated, performing. Y'all tell me if she got the new music. Uh, I ain't really. I'm not really that familiar. Let me know though. Uh, it's a lot of, lot of, you know, fluffiness on her thing. But what y'all think about the look? Mickey Guyton, girl got in trouble like being this black girl country music. I think she hosted the CMAs. She made a couple of white folks mad. She got that song, Lay It On Me, and uh, Drunk and I Miss You. But yeah, Mickey Guyton. Killing in the Nashville in the country music scene. I like her. She's my girl. She did an interview with us. Tierra Thomas. Uh, I like the, uh, the knots. I like the knots. Not sure, like, what she's, what's her music right now. Not sure about the rest of the outfit. I mean, it, it works. It's fashionable. It's fashionable. But the knots are going off. The um, What do you call those things? they perfect, though. Hair is on point. That's your boy, uh, uh, Lucky Day. Y'all know Lucky Day. He's usually, like, featured on other people's songs. But, you know, y'all know Lucky Day. He been doing this thing. So, yeah. That's a lot of green. But I see what you're doing. Sweetie. Now, I guess uh, she blew up this year for uh, her collab with uh, with Doja Cat. That's my best friend. Oh, my, 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 and my own money. Yeah, all that. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, that's, that's that. And she got the look. She got the whole pink thing. Short haircut, short haircut. I, I could get with it. I could get with it. She's looking good. I remember, you know, what I also remember about her. She had that McDonald's uh, combo or something with the chicken McNuggets and the sandwich and something else. Like they was doing the Saweetie special. I don't know. Y'all tell me about that one. My man Nas. And that's his door to destiny. And check out how the photographers don't even know who to photograph. Like, they really worried about his daughter. And, you know, they, he should be like, keep the cameras off my motherfucking daughter. But, nah, he ain't do that. But, um, that's Nas, man. You know, that's one of the greatest lyricists of all time. And, uh, camera, stay on Nas. Leave his daughter alone. Stay on Nas. That's my man right there. Uh, this is another country music artist, black, her name Yola. I'm not sure what she's wearing. She, she's, I don't know, the look, I don't know, I don't know her style. I gotta get more familiar with the music, but, um, I, you know, what do y'all think about that? What, what's going on there? I don't know. Yola for you. Eric Billinger, now this dude came on talking about, yeah, I wish I'm going to get... We, we got dude on carpet a while ago, a couple of Grammys ago, like four or five Grammys ago. And now here he is, nominated this year. Big stuff, That's I guess that's his girl, I'm not sure. She looks familiar though, do I know who she is? 
Lamaya good. Okay. 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 Lamaya good. I see. I see what you're doing. Is that making good? Uh, she looks like making good a little bit. Is that making good, sister? You got to figure that out. That's Lamaya good and Eric Billinger. Okay. I see what you're doing. There. I don't know about the, the shirtless thing, but bro, you cool with me. You cool with me. Shout us out on IG. I ain't got nothing bad to say for you. Uh, you know, you you want to go topless? Do your thing, Eric Billinger. That's that's you. Um, I don't know how she got on there. D Dice. Now this the dude I'm talking about reinventing yourself. I mean, he's been doing his thing, but the pandemic gave him a window and he took it. And everybody knew his pandemic parties and jammed out to it. And there goes Megan D. Stallion. Now, if you zoom in on her feet, she might be missing a pinky toe. But I'm not sure. It's just a rumor. But you know what I'm saying? But she looking good. I mean, I, I, I guess she going for that that that, that, so, that uh, safari look. And let me see if we got all the toes there. One, two, three. I don't see the gunshot. Then she, uh, you know, I don't mind my business. That's Megan the Stallion. All right, all right, cameraman, keep it on her. Keep it on her, cameraman. We're going to see what's up with that. We're going to see what's up with that. What we got next? Uh, okay, I like that we just staying on. We got to be stuck on Megan the Stallion. I like that. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. Woo! Okay. All right, Megan the Stallion. Who we got? And that... And they're gonna do. They ain't even announcing. I don't even. I don't know. I'm sure he got some good. He look a little familiar. My bad. I can't remember. Oh, I know who that dude is. What's that dude's name, man? Oh, they go. She got. She done. Baby, forget Megan the Stallion. Back to Megan the Stallion. Can't remember. Like, no, nah, we going right back to Megan the Stallion. Okay. Woo. I like the little line. She like she in Zamunda. Wakanda. Boy, uh, Jenadiah, Jediah, Jenadiah. My bad for messed up your name, man. But, uh, that is a quite unique look you got there. I'm about to say Curtis Blow. That's Grandmaster Flash. Wearing the same thing he wore to every Grammys for the last 20 years. He just always wearing like some suit like that. It might be the same suit. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna hold you. Doesn't he doing his thing though, you know? Salute to the to the legends. But somebody get that man to tell you. Somebody send him a new suit. You know what I'm saying? Send this dude a new look. You got some Iversons on? I don't know what he wearing, man. Send, oh, yo. Oh, yeah, about to see some gangster shit right here. Now, you see how they got going line. They already preparing signs. And they got all those lines of celebrities. Leslie Odom. And all these celebrities back there. And here go Lenny Kravitz like, man, fuck y'all. That's my time. I'm coming up here, man. I ain't waiting in no line. I'm wearing uh, Prince boots and everything. I'm Lenny Kravitz. You know what I'm saying? My, my daughter, uh, uh, Catwoman. And you know what I'm saying? Like, I was Lenny Kravitz, man. You know, I'm a rock star. This is how I do it. I don't wait in no line. You don't never see no rock star waiting in line. What, what y'all thinking? This me, Lenny Kravitz. That, that was gangster. That might have been the most gangster thing I've seen on the carpet for this year's Grammys. I mean, Lenny Kravitz just like, <laughs> fuck your line. I'm going right past all y'all. Deal with it. That's what I'm talking about. Lenny Kravitz. I, I, I feel it. I feel it. I don't know about the look, but you know, some people, you know, what's, what's, this is somebody, it's good for somebody. Somebody like that shit. You know, somebody gonna rock that Lenny Kravitz. They ain't gonna take all day after they gonna jump line. They gonna get, they, they get a girl like a little millisecond. And she's like, oh, well, it was my turn. All right, Leslie Odom Jr. Y'all, y'all be, y'all might know him from, I don't know, a lot of stuff. He was in, uh, 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 one night in Miami, he's been on uh, Hamilton. He's the man. He be doing this thing, you know. He be doing this thing. I I don't know about the look, but you know I ain't gonna hate on him. I like Leslie Odom Jr. That's my boy. Well, you know whatever. Cynthia Erivo. If y'all seen her do the genius of the Aretha Franklin thing, she killed it. She could sing. She could act. Everybody got mad at her for doing Harry Tubman, but you know it is what it is. Paris Hilton. They used to call her white privilege. But, you know, that's Paris Hilton. She, she, she was engaged to baby with cash money for a second. I don't know what she's doing these days. Paris Hilton been on the carpets forever. 
And she's still wearing expensive stuff. And, you know, I mean, who, who gonna lie? She can get it. That's Paris Hilton. She can get it, but I don't know what to say she does, but be Paris Hilton. She, oh, she did she try to rap at one time or something? I don't. Y'all gotta look that up. This I don't know who that is. This is just, uh, I don't know. I don't know who that is and who decided to wear a lampshade to the Grammys, but, I mean, that's what he did, you know, more power to him. All right, who, uh, it, it, you know, it, it is what it is. Then you got Tanashi. I don't even remember what Tanashi do. No, we'll, we'll see. Uh, I don't know. Ty Dollar Sign. Next up on the carpet, then we got the pronoun her. <clears throat> then we got into it last time at the Grammys, but there she go. Dua Lipa. Looking good at some black joint. I kind of like the outfit. It's kind of unique. Nice flex. Okay, here come your boy. Here come your boy. Mr. Not Talking to the Black Press himself. Mr. Lil Nas X. I don't know who these people with them, but maybe y'all know who they are. I don't know. Part of his crew, I don't know. He's definitely the only one in a space suit. I think that's the only one the photographers want. They're like, please, other people move out the way. Let's check out this space suit. Jimmy Jam. And I don't know who that is, huh? She's young. I don't want to say. <clears throat> I don't know who that is. Y'all find out who it is. Let me know. Jimmy Jam do a staple on the carpet. He's probably been at every Grammys since Prince was in the revolution. Respect to the OG. But who is that? I don't know. Y'all tell me. Find out in the comments. Tell me who is this with Jimmy Jam, please. Oh, Miss. Bonnie Kate. Another OG. Legend. Part of the Recording Academy. Trevor Noah, the host for the night. Looking a little disheveled for the carpet, to be honest. I don't know about this look. He got this tux looks a little bit <clears throat> banged up. <clears throat> and his assistant is in straight, like, I don't know, like athletic gear. I don't know what's up with this look. You got to do better, Trevor. I don't know. Bow tie off. Trevor could have been better. Well, now that I, I don't know. <clears throat> For all the believers, what is up with this suit? I don't remind me of that Kanye West video. It's Justin Bieber and uh, I forget his wife's name, but that's his his wife. And I don't know. <clears throat> I don't know what's up with this look. I mean. Is he hiding somebody in the jacket? He's sneaking somebody into the Grammys in that jacket, I think. I think it's like his whole crew is in the thing. And I hate when they say give her a kiss for the camera. Come on, man. They don't got to do that for the ph photographers. But what is up with this suit? I mean, jeez Louise. This can't even be comfortable wearing something that big. 
Maybe it's the new look. Maybe he just fashioned for it. And next year, everybody will be wearing suits 20 sizes too big. Y'all tell me if I'm just not on it yet. Maybe I just don't know. Y'all keep me in the loop. For real though, what y'all think about this suit? I'm not too impressed with his wife outfit either. That looks really just like some draperies just draped on her, but of course the little fake kiss. I don't know who that hottie is, but again, you guys help me out. I know y'all used to all the fashion gurus telling y'all like, oh, she's wearing this and that and that's such and such. This ain't that type of breakdown. This just for my people. Black Tree audience, y'all check it out. Who is this chick in the, in the see-through thing? You know what I mean? It, look, it looks nice, though. I like it. It's impressive. I don't know who she is. Y'all know who she is? She looks kind of familiar. Back to the believers. Who is he hiding in that suit? I don't know. He might be a school shooter. He could have shotguns, anything in that suit. Is that what y'all doing in Canada now? Y'all tell me. Y'all tell me if that's the new look in the six. I don't know what's going on. Back to the hottie. Who is she? Oh, this is... I don't know. Look cute. What about the pink bow in the back? Like maybe she should have like matched the bow with the purse. It's kind of I don't know. Again, I'm not your fashion guru. Go to your stylist. Joe exclusive. Tell me what's up. What is this? EJ. All your stylists out there. What is the look? This is, Sweetie is, now she might be the only person that came on the carpet twice. She brought two looks. But again, this is a four hour carpet. So, if you're in part one of the show, part two of the show, maybe you do come with two different looks. Which one y'all like first? The pink look or this look? I kind of like this better. I kind of like this outfit better, but. Y'all let me know. Oh, the back is hot. Look at that. That's just, it's tight. Yeah, I, I'd definitely go with look two. But y'all tell me, which one did y'all like? Look one or look two? And there go Chloe. But see, every time I see her, I look the other way. Because I always feel like she's 14. I don't know how old she is. But I know that, you know, Chloe and Halle are like some youngsters. And I don't know. And it's Jared Leto. He's just... He's just a, the too sexy guy for everything. I remember when 21 Pilots, he got a new show on Apple TV called We Crash about the WeWork thing, and he did House of Gucci. Great actor. Uh, who is this? I don't know. Back to Jared. I'm surprised he got shoes on. Now, if y'all seen We Crash, I know what I'm talking about. He should be walking around barefoot. But I guess he's doing his 21 Pilots thing and not his actor thing. Jerry Little, he's cool. I, I like I like dude. He's cool dude. Who is this? I know this person. I can't really put my... Any of y'all got COVID amnesia? Y'all can't forget... Y'all, y'all forget people whose faces y'all seen two, three years ago. Y'all used to know the name. Oh, that's my guy, Reading Rainbow. Reading Rainbow. They should have gave him the job for the Jeopardy thing. They fronted on him. And there go Lady Gaga. With Jermaine Dupree. That ain't Jermaine Dupree. My bad, JD. Look, I thought that was JD with Lady Gaga. I mean, he already had Janet. Why not? Y'all remember Lady Gaga used to wear stuff like meat on the carpet? Like, she used to wear these craziest outfits. Now she's 
Becky in more traditional beauty as the actor singer. She don't do that crazy outfits no more. I like the jewelry. I like the jewelry. A dude had to wear a do rag though. I mean, I don't know. If I was with Lady Gaga, I wouldn't have a do rag on. Too cool though. All right, that's that's about it. Um, I gave y'all enough of the carpet. I might do a part two. Y'all tell me like, what was y'all favorite fashion on here? What did y'all like best? What was the craziest? Did y'all like that Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle outfit? I don't know. Y'all tell me what's going on. And y'all stay tuned to Black Tree TV for more uh, fashion carpet since this year. They didn't give... Oh, this guy, he tore up the show. What is... He tore up the show at the end. What was his name? That guy, he really got it in. I do like him. John Batiste. He did the little Afro uh, performance at the end. I, you know, new cat. Check him, check him out. Interesting outfit. It's Grammy for it. I feel it. I feel it. So that's it. Y'all tell me what y'all think.